this video is going to show you guys how I make the pattern for making my frontals 13 by 4 and 13 by 6 <laughs> Please welcome back to my channel. My name is Vibra and I'm still your favorite wig vlog. Alright, on this channel I share anything hair and wigs, hair tips, wig tips, DIYs and lots of tutorials. This channel also covers lifestyle and vlogs so expect a lot of vlogs on this channel. And so guys, this is a 13 by 6 frontal i made this with a pixie curl 8 inch i have not treated it i'm going to take this for a really good treat i'll definitely show you guys what it looks like after all right and this is another one i'm about to make this is going to be a 13 by 4 frontal i'm going to make this with a bouncy hair i'm not really sure about the length but this video is going to show you guys how I make the pattern for making my frontals. I use pattern because it's quite easy for me and it makes me not to get confused. So someone, a lot of you have been asking me to show you guys how I make the pattern for a frontal. And this video will do just that. I'll show you guys how I make a pattern for a full frontal. 13 by 4 and 13 by 6. I also have lots of videos showing you guys how I make a closure pattern. So you can go ahead and watch that video. So guys, I want you all to watch this video to the end because it's going to be really, you know. <laughs> so I'll see you at the end of this video. So if you're yet to subscribe, please subscribe to this channel and turn on post notification so you don't miss out on any new content i upload drafting this pattern is pretty easy all you'll need is your ruler your pen your scissors a plain sheet of paper and your measuring tape i'll advise you use a piece of paper wide enough to accommodate 13 inches I went ahead to measure my paper and it wasn't up to 13 inches so I attached an extra paper Since the width of my paper is already 13 inch, I'll go ahead and mark the middle point of 13 inch, which is 6.5. Because this is for a 13 by 6 frontal, I'll be marking a depth of 6 inch. So I'm placing my tape on the middle point where I made my markings earlier and I'll mark at 0 and at 6 inch. And then I'll connect my markings by ruling it out. This middle point will help us achieve an accurate curve. You'll see what I mean as we proceed. Now I'll transfer the 6 inch mark I made on the middle point to both sides of the paper. Now I'll go ahead and make a curve from the middle point to the edge and I'll do this for both sides. I'm going to make use of my free hand but if you have a curved ruler, I'd advise you use it because it will give you a more perfect curve. To create the 13 by 4 frontal, I'll place my tape on the middle point 
and mark out a depth of 4 inch. Then I'll go ahead and draw a curved line to meet with the other curved line. <laughs> you can do this better than me guys. After drawing the curved line, I'll label appropriately. I left the hairline empty, I'll create the hairline after I place this paper on my dummy. It's a paper guys, it will surely fold, but I'm trying to reduce the folding by creating mini darts on the paper. So guys, for the paper to be flatly laid, I had to create mini darts on the side of the paper, but that caused the curved lines to be uneven. You can go back in with your pen to blend the lines in to correct it. I think I did that later off camera. So guys, this is what it looks like. I'll go ahead and place my lace net on this and secure it down with paints. I told you guys earlier that I was going to create the airline for this frontal much later. I'm going to leave the link to that video in the description box, so please go ahead and watch that video, alright? Guys, we've come to the end of this video. If this video was helpful, give this video a thumbs up also leave all questions you have in the comment section and i'm going to respond to them all most importantly don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications i don't want you to miss out on any new uploads that i make all right guys that's it i'll see you in my next video thank you so much for watching bye